Uh, you alright mate? I'm so excited. I'm trying to vlog here mate. Hey guys, how's it going? It's vlog time. It's your boy here, Jazzy B. Do you oh, that was sure that. No, no, good. <laughs> just at Leicester Square. Well, we're just leaving Leicester Square with Lucy. Hello. Just done a podcast, Spencer's podcast, the Big Fish. Should be out. They said next week, so maybe by the time the vlog's up. Might be. You might be able to check it out by the time this vlog comes out, which is really nice. I really enjoyed it. Got to got to talk about myself and got to talk about things that, and answer questions that maybe people want to know about or that I don't particularly really get asked that often so I really enjoyed it and we finished sort of about half hour early mm -hmm. so I just said to Lucy come on let's go and uh, let's go and get a little gin before we have to go home so why not oh yeah two I was in a play <laughs> thanks for reminding me and by the way this is the palace theatre um, where Les Miserables used to be at and uh, I was Gavroche uh, at that theatre I mean, I could yeah, go on. Were, Listen, I've got loads of things I could brag about, sure. But yeah, we're going to have a little gin. It's the afternoon. And then uh, back home with the kids. And we'll go and see what what Claire's doing with her life while I'm doing podcasts and drinking gin in London. <laughs> All right, here we go. Another day, another Fred Perry. This is quickly turning into a montage of just me walking around London. Back in London. Look at us vlogging while crossing the road. This is. Going to get run over. Oh, does he want to go or not? Uh, you alright, mate? Um, we're back in London. I think he was to me. No, he was talking to me. Of course he was. What are we doing in London, Claire? You've yeah. not been on the vlog yet. Oh, hello. I did a little intro yesterday, and then I thought we'd maybe do something yesterday evening, but couldn't be couldn't be bothered. We are going to do Messi's Giovanna Fletcher's podcast. Have yeah. mum had a baby? No, I've not had a baby for a while, so... And you've not been happy for years. Happy mum, happy kids, happy wife, happy life. So I'm just sort of on a... On a uh, pod... Wait, yeah, talking. yeah, of course, yeah. <laughs> I'm on a uh, podcast tour at the moment. I did a podcast yesterday with um, Spencer Matthews. Yeah, how is he? Nice posh. guy, nice guy. Very posh, very polite. Interesting bloke. Yeah, what are you doing? What, are you just trying to stay relevant, Jimmy? Um, that's all this is, isn't it? It's just one big claim, isn't it? You've just got to it never used to. It never used to be important to be What's relevant. The punch? That's the handles I've That is, the yeah, yeah. Maybe we'll have a look in there, a little buster oh, no, and punch. Oh, too dear. Way too dear. Well, hey, listen. If I keep, doing, keep all, doing podcasts. I keep doing all these podcasts, <laughs> you're going to be rolling in it. Right, uh, we're coming up to the place now. So uh, we'll love you and leave you for now. So here we are, we're at Wembley to see Blur. Can you believe it, Claire? I can't believe it. I can't believe it, Claire. Um, no, I've never seen Blur before. I'm so excited. The boys are excited. Claire's excited. What I want to know is, are you excited? Well, you should be. <laughs>
Are you feeling? Another day, another trip to London. Not sure what this uh, this week's episode is going to. Oh, he's there, isn't he? I'm trying to vlog here, mate. Not sure what this vlog is looking like at the moment. I think it's just a couple of clips of me and Claire, or me and Claire, me and or Claire, just saying things like, uh, "Here we are in London." This might explain why. Uh, this week's vlogs a bit is even more sh than normal, um, just because we've been really busy. But I'm in London today because I'm doing something called uh, it's called an ADR session, um, which is basically is for this thing that I've done called the Horde, um, a TV show that will be on TV at some point, either this year or next year. I don't know. But what ADR is is basically it's a sound thing, so. Maybe, there, maybe I mumbled a line, or maybe there was some noise in the background when I said a line. It's basically, there's something wrong with the sound. So I have to go in and re-say my lines and say them in sync with my lips on a screen. It's quite tedious and quite boring, and also it sounds rubbish. I think you can always tell when stuff has been ADR'd because it's very difficult to deliver the line in, in the exact same way as you did it in the, you know, in the performance on the occasion. So, little update for you. Ever so boring, sorry about that. Nothing interesting going on. Blur was great. I'll hopefully see Claire this evening and <laughs> maybe we can sit down on the couch, have a little chat and catch up properly on the vlog instead of, um, all this nonsense. So that's the uh, ADR session done. Uh, now I've got to jump on a train, head back home, see Claire and the kids. That's quite exciting. I got to see a few scenes and see a bit of an e uh, of the edit. I'm quite, I'm quite excited about it. I think people are going to really like it. It's quite grim. I thought it was going to be funnier because, <laughs> uh, well, you know, I'm in it. Like, can't help it, I'm like an idiot with whatever I do. But um, yeah, it's quite dark. Obviously I'll, uh, I'll be letting you guys know all the details when I find out. I'm not sure when it'll be on TV, but you'll hear it from me. Do I get a pint or do I go home? I'm gonna stop the vlog here so that I can decide not on camera. Okay, I'm in the little uh, playroom slash music room these days, eh Harrison? Mm -hmm. God knows we're uh, 
we're struggling for uh, for content this week. But of course, we've uh, we've had blur fever, haven't we? Mm -hmm. Mum's here. But yeah, we haven't got much. Uh, we haven't got much going on in the vlog, Claire. Oh, I know. It seemed like it was exciting because we were like, we're going here, we're yeah. going here, and then we just never ever did anything again. But you know, that's. But Harrison, uh, yeah. I've just been explaining. We've had we've had blur fever in the house. Oh God, yeah. I've never um, heard so much blur in my life. Obviously, leading up to the gig, and then going to the gig, which was absolutely amazing. Mm -hmm. We all loved it so much. Ah. Um, but Harrison, especially, has found a uh, sort of this new appre pre appreciation for Alex James, haven't you? Yeah. He's such a great bass player, isn't he? Yeah. He's so good. I don't know whether you hear it enough. People should be screaming at him, like from the rooftops how great Alex James is on bass. Yeah. I don't know if it's because I don't play bass. I don't hear, you know, I don't hear about people talking about other bass players. But he's so brilliant. And um, Damon's voice was still great. It was good. He had to sing a couple of songs um, in a lower key, which was a bit of a shame. See, I wouldn't have noticed that. I don't know. Which was a bit of a shame because I like to, I like to sing along. And you're very high, aren't I you? I like to go. Yeah, I like to go high. So me and Harrison are going to play a song now just to pad out this vlog. <laughs> but Harrison's been learning the bass, and he's been working really hard on it. Yeah, because you can't play the bass. No. It's really hard to play the bass. I know, but I'm just saying, you know the hard jobs to hard. No, he just started playing the bass. He said, Dad, could you play guitar to this? Because I've been learning the bass part yeah, to right. it. What, what are you playing? Uh, coffee and TV, yeah? Yeah. Do a little, the, do you know the chorus to it? Or do you just know the verse? I just know the verse. All right, let's do it. We'll do a verse, see if I can remember it as well. All right. One, two, three, four. <laughs> sounded really good if I could have been bothered to tune this guitar. Mm. That was sounding great mate. And you've started to try to learn the boys and girls in here but that is tough. So you've got to learn it and then you've got to also do the do the bopping as well, the Alex James, James bop. But they were so good. They were so good. And I was actually I felt bad for Alex James because... You were looking on the big screen. But... They didn't really show him that much, no. did they? I think, I think that's on purpose. I, I imagine that Alex James is quite a sort of... I don't know him personally. Um, but I don't think... I think he's happy to let... He's the judge of the band. I think he's happy to let sort of Damon Alburn and Graham Coxon a little bit. I don't think he's interested in being centre of attention. I know, but, but he can't help it because he's so good at the bass. I'm, bless him. God bless him. I'm pretty sure throughout the whole concert he was only on the thing for like six times. Yeah. I'd be a bit like. I did. Can't. I wanted to see more. I wanted to see him go. I didn't want to. I didn't want to. I didn't want to see him. No. <laughs> I wanted to see him yeah. playing. That's what I wanted to see. We loved and loved Blur, and the shows were amazing. The shows were absolutely amazing. We felt really lucky that we got to be there. And it just was, it really was a special night for us, wasn't it? It's something that I think we'll remember forever yeah. as a family. Hey, Harrison, have you heard this song before? What song am I gonna play? Um, Something's of Swing. Uh, no, you don't know that. Yeah, I do. Right, well, let me know if you can guess it. Just for context, so Dad plays this song literally all the time. Every time he picks up a guitar, I don't even know how to play it. This is the song he plays. <laughs> and one day we were 
in a restaurant and the song came on and I'm like, oh dad, this is the song you play all the time. And I was just thinking, wait, you actually play this like all the time. And that just became a thing where every time he picks up a, gu a guitar, he goes, Hazem, what's this? Because if I'm going to be totally honest, he doesn't really know I don't know how to play other it. songs. I don't know how to play this one. This solo that I just made up. Listen to this. That was my little solo. <laughs> that was my little solo. <laughs> I need to wash oh. my hair so bad. Yeah. yeah, you do. Um, hey, listen, we're probably gonna say goodbye for this week. Goodbye, my lover. What was I say? Bit of a scrapbook. Is that how I would describe this week's vlog? Patchwork. A little bit of a patchwork. Um, probably won't be a very long one, but we have been very busy. Might just I put explained. a whole block on, sir. Um, I think we'd get sued if we did that. Ah. They must be bringing out some kind of DVD or documentary to go along with it. We'll be back next week with more nonsense. We will. Don't know what the future holds for us right now. Usually we go, oh, we've got this coming up next week, so stay tuned for that, but don't know what we might be doing something interesting. Don't know yet. <laughs> You're all right, James. I'm stressed. Calm down, son. It's all right. Everything's going to be fine. Uh, we'll be back next week. What else? What just else? trying to just trying to think. If there's anything I need to mention? Anything that we're trying to sell you? No, no, or... no sponsor this week. No. And oh, guys, I don't know if you've noticed this, but we turned our adverts off on YouTube a long time ago. Yeah. Don't know if any of you have appreciated it or you have noticed it. <laughs> yeah, can we just get a pat on the back, please? Well, yeah, because they were always complaining too many adverts, too many adverts. Yeah, obviously. So we said, we'll turn it off. Obviously, we do ad reads and stuff. That's how the world works. But we did turn off the ads that run through our videos, so there shouldn't be any you more ads. Be. And if you are getting ads coming up, like, because you can't see Recent them. ones. The can't last skip them anymore on YouTube. The last time we had adverts was when we did the vlog for Miles Kane's music video. So that was about four months ago. Yeah, that was the last time we had adverts. So yeah, just let us know if it's making a difference or if we can turn them back on and earn some money. No, don't worry about that. Let me know if you would seen an advert because I'm going to kick off then. Nobody wants that. No, but it, it wouldn't surprise me. No, they That we've turned be. off adverts and yet they still sneak them in. Yeah, well, let us know. Um, thank you for watching. Thanks for sticking with us. We'll see you next week. And, uh, oh! Here's something to look forward to next week. Um, we've been given a new pizza oven. So next week we'll set up the pizza oven? Yeah, I'm going to set up the pizza oven. And we'll get the barbecues up on the deck. And maybe. maybe. We'll see. We're still looking at kitchens. Yeah, I want to I wanna wait until we've got a plan before I start moving all those all things. Alright, alright. Alright, see you next week. Say bye Claire. Bye Claire. Stay scummy.